down here at uh, Vermont Home Days in Bellows Falls, and I'm outside of a, uh, a tiny house built by Jamaica Cottage Shack. Jamaica Cottage Shop. Jamaica Cottage Shop, and I'm here with Mindy. Yep. <laughs> uh, tell me about this house. This is an 8x16 tiny house. We call it the Charlotte Vale. Uh, it's basically built to be used for full-time living, or it could be used as a you know a camping cabin or a, you know a guest house it's got four season insulation um, a solar package an electric hookup uh, a dry flush toilet um, let's see um, solid fuel heater <laughs> and a direct vent propane heater a sink um, and a shower wow. and two lofts that sounds like a lot going on in such a tiny space yeah <laughs> so what sort of heater did you say it was it's got solid fuel, which is like a little miniature wood stove that's used in boats. Mm -hmm. And then it also has a propane direct vent heater. So you could use one or the other for most of the time, and then the rest, the other one could be used as a backup. Mm -hmm. And what was the name again? For the tiny house? The it's house. A, the 8x16 Charlevale. I don't know that word. Yeah, it's um, one of my coworkers came up with it, and it has something to do with... Um, traveling i don't really remember the exact <laughs> definition but it's definitely has it's, it's in the urban dictionary okay well <laughs> when i step in here in just a minute and look around what should i keep an eye out for um there's some very cool stained glass round owls made by manchester hot glass um i definitely recommend checking out the the staircase because it also doubles as storage and a counter mm -hmm. um the bathroom's kind of cool it's very compact um yeah I'd say those are the coolest things. And now the ugly question. How much does it cost? We're This is currently on sale for $49,929. It mm -hmm. normally goes for close to sixty. dollars um, We can build these fully custom built uh, starting as low, you know, if you go get it with just a shell, not on a trailer, as low as around eight grand. It Would really that... just depends on what how much you have us do with it for the price. Would eight grand include insulation? No, okay. <laughs> definitely not. <laughs> I would say it, we could probably do one very simple for around with insulation for around thirty-five thousand, but it would not include electric and plumbing. Okay. So that's a possibility. Great. I'm gonna yeah. take a look around. Thanks. Sure. Thank you. Don't want to leave a drink ring on there, a nice windowsill. Or it turns it into 12 volt DC. It's a regulator. It's either a regulator or an inverter. So, probably a regulator. We do have some larger so you're taking it off the It's charging the battery. And the battery will have an inverter attached to it. Bay window area. The bay window adds $2,100. Solar electric adds. The wood stove adds almost $1,900. The propane heater adds $1,500. is to get your camera way back in the corner and use a fisheye lens in your one room cabin looks huge. And in fact, 
Pretty darn small. Hi there. Hi, how are you? Good, and you? I'm uh, doing well. What's your name? Mary. Mary? Yeah. Hi, I'm KMO. Hi. Nice, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Oh, this is more spacious than the other two. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Is it all right if I, uh, if I film in here? I think it is. All righty. Is it all right if I film you? Why not? Okay. Well, <laughs> what can you tell me about this place? Well, what would you like to know? Well, uh, is it made by uh, J the Jamaica company yeah. as well? No. No. So this, this is a different this is, outfit. Yeah, this is made by my son, mm -hmm. um, Kevin from Kevlar Contractors. Mm -hmm. And um, he's building this for his son and himself. Okay. So this is, this is he's actually going to live here. This will be a primary residence. Yeah, it'll be his primary residence. Oh, wow. How long has it been under construction, do you know? Um, probably about um, 10 months, but he's been doing it gradually. He works full-time and so you know he has to um he has to go to work so this is what he does on weekends and is this his first tiny house that he's built yes wow you know how long ago he got interested in the idea uh, about a year ago so he's jumped right into action yeah right on yeah yeah. Wow. yeah you know what the footage is yeah it's uh 250 square feet ah it's probably all right here on the wall yeah How are you? Good, how are you? Excellent. You this made is this? gorgeous. Kevin did. Oh, he did? Yeah. Is this the ladder to get to the loft? Or you yeah. <laughs> it's temporary. So he's wow. building stairs that will come down, and um, you'll be able to have doors inside of the drawers, inside mm -hmm. of the stairs. Yeah, that's cool. So you get storage inside of there also. That is um, a queen size bed. Wow. And um, this is going to be the shower right here. Oh, okay. With the shower curtain. Yeah. And the circular ones. Yeah. Composting toilet. Wow. This is the water tank, but then it's also his son's bed. Bed. That's and, a good idea. Yeah. And then, of course, there'll be a wall here. Wow. There'll be more cabinet space behind where that you're standing. That is phenomenal. Um, double sink. Here and um, there's more storage under there. Yeah. Wow. You can put storage up there also, or you can, or it can be able to sleep. Yes, yeah. yeah. And um, this is going to be um, a sofa, a sitting area. Oh, okay. The table's going to be up against the wall. Wow. Fold down. There'll be one, two, three, four. That's cool. awesome. I was just telling the girl outside, don't like your neighbors, just leave. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Wow. Trader. Yeah. I that. That's where he lives. I know. That's awesome. Yeah. Oh, oh sorry. That's no, okay. I don't know. I've never been in one. I've seen them. Well, you can take it cross-country, too. Now, do you need a CDL to pull it, or? No. Wow, that's Just even better. Look it up to your truck. Yeah, that's even better. better. Yeah, that's the other truck. That's awesome. awesome. I was about to say your little Kia. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Not quite. This one's better. Wow. Thank you. Oh, that's a good one.